with the sounds of the shehnai and dholki in the air and with lights so bright that they catch heaven's attention an indian wedding is a sight to behold traditions may have changed with the passage of time but one element has stood firm in its many shapes forging lasting bonds is the everlasting brilliance of gold a symbol of purity and security this metal has many stories to tell if only you hold it close and listen it goes right back to the vedic age when a swayamvar would be held for a woman who would choose a worthy husband from among her suitors she would garland the man she wanted to marry adorned with magnificent and regal jewelry everyone in the room would be adorned in gold even the visitors because gold was considered auspicious and meant to protect the bride from evil gold followed the bride into her married life as well of all the jewels she would wear nut became the most popular in this century the wives of kings wore a large gold nut studded with pearls and kundan as symbols of their wealth and status as more kings and warriors wielded power in this land gold found its place in designs that would survive for centuries gold jewelry carried the fervor of the rajputs down the ages bearing patterns of crocodiles and snakes the bride would wear an ard gifted by her family the groom would wear the baju band which eventually became popular among women the mangal sutra traveled through the ages too it is a black and gold necklace worn by married women that tells the world of their marital status as time passed dynasties rose and fell but gold shimmered in the attire ornaments and coins at every wedding from the paintings on the wall to the armor they wore gold acquired a throne of its own from jewelry it made its way into intricate art forms appearing in zardozi and ari the attire worn by the bride and groom on their most special day the star of the wedding the bride would be decked entirely in gold from the mang tikka on her head to the pile on her feet when the westerners arrived at her doorsteps gold enticed many it was worn with much aplomb at every occasion possible the deep yellows of gold contrasted against the attire of kings western travelers married indian princesses embracing the indian tradition gold found itself becoming a part of a lineage a token of security that was bequeathed unto the bride today gold remains as important a part of weddings as it was centuries ago that's precisely why the price of gold peaks during the wedding season in any corner of india at any time in history gold has played a part in every indian wedding connecting generations and families in an eternal bond the purest of them all